Should the AFL ditch the white shorts for the away team rule? Personally, I think they should. For decades now, the AFL has operated on a traditional rule of coloured shorts for the home team and white shorts for the away team. While this rule isn't super strict, it is still quite commonly used. Meanwhile, the AFLW has introduced a new rule for the 2023 season where no team will wear white shorts due to the comfort and needs of players in the women's league. As a result of this no white shorts policy, we've seen a lot of unusual Guernsey and short combinations that we wouldn't typically see in the AFL, such as Richmond wearing their yellow clash jumper with black shorts, West Coast wearing a gold jumper with blue shorts, similar to what the men's team wore when they originally joined the VFL back in 1987, and Essendon wearing black shorts with their red clash jumper. This new policy has essentially forced teams to test run combinations that they never would have otherwise, and the results of this have actually been pretty interesting. West Coast is a prime example where the gold jumper and blue shorts looks a lot better than with white shorts, as the men's team usually wears, and in most cases, this shouldn't be a big issue with avoiding clash. In fact, there might be some cases where white shorts cause more of a clash issue. In recent Anzac Day clashes between Collingwood and Essendon, we've seen the Bombers refuse to wear their clash jumper, and instead wear their home jumper with white shorts. This takes a black and red team and unnecessarily adds white to their kit, which only makes the clash worse against a black and white team. If Essendon refused to wear their red clash jumper, an alternate solution would be to wear red shorts with their home jumper. Not only does this work as traditional as Essendon wore this combination back in the 70s, but it also helps to eliminate some of the clash by making Essendon's kit majority red. Some other examples of this would be what if Carlton wore navy blue shorts with their white jumper or a sky blue jumper against Collingwood. It may not be traditional, but they might be more open to this combo as it looks a bit better than an all sky blue kit. This could also open up other options that'd just look good. Frio could wear their white jumper with purple shorts, Brisbane could wear the Fitzroy away jumper with the traditional blue shorts, and Collingwood could wear their white clash jumper with black shorts, which again is a traditional combination. So let me know if you think the AFL should be done with the white shorts rule in the comments below, and I'll see you next time.